My name is David Powell, and I want to talk about uh, SB 396. That it was put off the inactive file. Um, it's a magazine ban. It's actually worse than the Connecticut law that was uh, passed uh, a few months ago, and uh, 87 or 89 percent of the population decided not to comply with that law. They wanted to uh, register the magazines. And California actually wants to outright ban the magazines. Um, don't don't comply with that law. It, it's it's an ex post facto law, and it will um, essentially uh, criminalize you for doing something that was previously legal. It's actually legal to possess 30 round magazines, um, and it's actually legal to use pre ban 30 round magazines. Well, 20 round magazines, so for anything higher than 10 round, as long as it's pre banned, you could still use it. Um, however, for them to say that you need to destroy your magazines or uh, turn them in to the police, you know, um, that, that's just outright crazy, to be honest. I mean, uh, my question is um, would the police department throw away their 30 round magazines? Is the military going to throw away their 30 round magazines? Is the ATF and the FBI, are they all going to do the same thing? Or are they above the law? And if they are above the law, well, guess what? I'm not following the law. And you'll have to come and kick our doors in to, to get our magazines. So we're not going to comply with a law that we were previous, that we weren't. It literally just criminalizes you. And if you actually read the law, it says, this law creates a new crime. It, it, it's outright ridiculous. So whatever you do, just don't even comply with it. They can't, they can't even enforce it. They don't know who has them and who doesn't. So how are they going to enforce it?